What's up guys, it's Andrew, some guy with tools. We got another Makita tool in today. This is the Makita XGT 40 volt max, seven and a quarter cordless rear handle circular saw, model number GSR01. Now this is the kit version, so it's GSR01M1. It includes the saw, a carrying bag, a charger, and one four amp hour battery. So we're gonna open it up, bring in closer, take a look, and then do a little bit of cutting with it. Okay guys, here it is, the GSR01 seven and a quarter rear handle circular saw from Makita. It is the XGT 40 volt max. I like how the battery placement is on this one. Very easy to slide in and out. You can also see the battery charge on the top. Raptor hook here on the back with a positive stop at 90 degrees makes it real easy to catch on something. Obviously that's not fitting there. Large thumb screw for your depth setting. Nice etched in numbers, easy to see for you. Magnesium blade guard, magnesium shoe. Another cool thing on the Makita saws, hopefully you can see it, is this bevel gauge, bevel adjustment right here on the front. So you can turn this stop, now it's set at 22.5, so when I set the bevel, it's gonna positively stop at 22.5 or I can turn this to 45 and it'll stop at 45 or the max bevel of 53 degrees makes it super easy super convenient for repetitive bevel adjustment now we're set at a good five degree angle let's make a cut real quick Nice, easy, clean cut, no problem for the saw. Let's go back to zero. Again. No problem at all cross cutting this two by eight. Let's grab a sheet of OSB and let's see what we got with that. Okay, turns out I don't have any OSB after all. I thought I did. But what I do have is a four foot wide sheet of three quarter inch ply. So let's go ahead and give that a rip. Let's give it one more go. The only reason it bogged was because I went crooked. No sweat at all for that guy. All right guys, so again, that's the GSR-01, seven and a quarter inch rear circular saw, rear handled circular saw from Makita on their new XGT 40 volt max platform. Special shout out to my friends at Factory Authorized Outlet for sending this one over. Without them, this video wouldn't have been possible. Make sure you check them out at factoryauthorizedoutlet.com or over on Instagram at shopfao. Greatly appreciate them sending this one out. Let me know down in the comments what you think about it. Is it worth upgrading from the previous 18 volt times 2 model? What do you think? I appreciate you guys checking out the video and I'll see you on the next one.